Rapunzel In a land, far away, lived a poor farmer and his wife. One day, they tried to pluck fruits from their neighbor's garden. But, little did they know, that their neighbor was actually an old, wicked witch. When she saw the farmer and his wife stealing her fruits, she screamed. I'll turn you into a rat. The couple trembled with fear. Finally, the witch said. I'll let you go. But you have to give me your first child. They were so scared, that they immediately agreed and fled. A few years later, a beautiful baby girl was born to the farmer and his wife. Immediately, the old witch came and snatched the girl away from them. She named her Rapunzel and the witch kept her locked up in a tall tower. She grew up to be a beautiful girl. But her most beautiful feature was her long, gold. Every day, the witch used to come to the foot of the tower and call. Rapunzel, Rapunzel, let down your hair. Rapunzel let her long play fall out the window, and the witch used to hold onto it and climb up. One day, a prince who was passing by heard a song coming from the tall tower. Curiously, he followed. There, he saw the old lady. He hid behind the trees and watched the witch. As soon as she left, he too decided to try. Rapunzel, Rapunzel, let down your hair. He cried and climbed up into her. She was stunned to see the prince. She had never seen anybody so handsome. The prince too fell in love with her. They began to meet secretly every day after the witch left. One day, Rapunzel mistakenly said to the witch, You are so much heavier than my prince. The witch realized what has been going on. She screamed and shouted in anger. She cut off her hair and sent her off deep into the forest. That day, when the prince came, he found the witch waiting for him at the tower. She cursed and screamed some more, before casting a spell on him, that made the prince lose his sight. The prince, now blind and with a broken heart, wandered through the forest. Many days later, Rapunzel found him wounded amongst the trees. She began to cry at the sorry sight of her prince. But as soon as her tears fell on him, his wounds healed, and his eyesight returned. The first thing the prince saw was his beloved. They were overjoyed to find each other again. They went away to his kingdom and lived happily ever after, far away from the wicked witch. Moral of the story. When something is destined to happen then no one, no matter how much power one has, can stop that from happening.